name is Cindy. I am at Simply Cindy. July by July 2nd, we have Pluto retrograde, which remember, he's saying to Aquarius, see, I was just, remember, I told you the scenario. For those of you that have never seen me, I see them as characters. I see these plans as characters and as um, uh, they have personality, right? And so Aquarius, because he's quirky and weird and um, doesn't like to show anybody that, when Pluto was coming to his house, leaving Capricorn, he only let him stay in the living room for a little bit. And that was last year. He like, it's it it's like only I'm only gonna let you stay in the living room. You can't like look in my house. Okay, you can stay in the living room. And then he went back to Capricorn and now he's come back to Aquarius. And when he came back, he brought some suitcases and he said and Aquarius said, Okay, that wasn't so bad. I'll let you have a room, right? And so Pluto said, you're going to love it. I know you don't like to live with people. I understand your quirkiness. I'm going to follow your rules. It's going to be okay. And Pluto is, I know this sounds crazy, but this is how it is. This is how they talk. This is how I see it. <laughs> and so Pluto was like, I'm going to show you what we can do together. Let's, let's, let's show them what we can do together. Look at the possibilities. We don't know what we're going to do yet. But let's show them what the possibilities are. And that's what he did as he went from zero degrees Aquarius into one degree Aquarius. And that's what we've been looking at as a society, right? Because there's certain rules that Pluto has to follow because it's Aquarius' house, right? Aquarius is about the people. Aquarius is about the groups. Aquarius sees different, uh, sees things very differently in a very unique way. And so for the first time, a lot of people had seen the possibilities of things we hadn't seen before, right? And that's what happened as he stayed in the room to the one degree, okay, Pluto. But, you know, Pluto says, well, if they're going to do this or if they can see this, they have to, like, get rid of this and they have to do that and they have to do that, right? That's a whole other thing. But... I mean, I can go deep, deep, deep. You guys know I've been going deep with Pluto. So, because Pluto's in my 12th house, he's transiting my 12th house. So I'm going to see Pluto in a very different way even than I see him today. So, anyway, at, so now when Pluto decided to go retrograde, he said, okay, now that I've we've shown them, now that I've shown you, Aquarius, that I can follow the rules, that it's going to be okay, that I'm thinking about the people, um, I'm going to, we need to like go over each of these degrees again and, and show them and remind them and say, what do you want to keep as a society? How do you want to grow? What are the possibilities that you're seeing? All of that, right? In the, in that same instant, in the same time period where he's at one degree right now, right? He is looking back at Capricorn and saying, I'm coming to finish stuff up. So he's kind of talking to both of them right now, right? Because we know energies don't stop and start. So he's kind of talking to Capricorn as well and saying, we got to finish what we what we started 15, 16 years ago. We have to finish that. And I know that some of it is stubborn and some of it doesn't want to come down. And it doesn't have to completely come down if it adjusts. We just need to change because where we're going is very different. And it's not about the structures. It's about the people. It's not about the systems. It's about the groups. It's not about what we have built in systems and what we are leaning too much on. It's about humanity leaning on each other when needed. Does that make sense? And that's what's happening as Pluto retrogrades. But he's still in Aquarius, so we're still seeing the possibilities. We're like, we already saw some possibilities, and we're like, okay, we're stronger than we think. We can see things. AI's coming, blah, 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 like all of that, right? But we're still looking at these structures that are having to fall. And the closer that Pluto gets to uh, Capricorn, we're going to fall. I mean, structures are going to fall. Systems are going to fall, right? Or they're going to change. They're going to adjust. And I told I told you guys six to eight months ago 
even structures and systems that you don't think can fail what did we just see we completely saw a system like not working uh because what they said that they were i don't know fixing issues or something um anyway i'm telling you even the ones that think and and look at our government i i've said this i said this a while back even even systems that you don't think could ever fail they will come down if they're not going to adjust right and that's just the truth of it so um at least that's what i'm getting at least that's what i'm getting when i'm conversing with them 